What's up everybody welcome to another honest review video today I have this red magic 8s pro this is the most favorite smartphone of mine at this moment but before we start the video I need to show you something well there are a lot of options available on the market these days if you want a foldable you can get a cheap foldable like Motorola Razr 40 Ultra and if you want to get something different and unique yeah there is this nothing phone too we also have Vivo X90 Pro almost a super flagship and definitely we have Oppo Find X6 Pro, a super flagship. But I have chosen this Red Magic 8S Pro because this one not only offers the best performance, but this one actually offers the best value for money at this moment. I mean, if you are looking for a gaming performer, yeah, we will also talk about the camera performance of Red Magic 8S Pro. Well, before everything, one request. If you end up liking this video, then please don't forget to click on the like button and please subscribe to this channel. Support honest reviews. Well, I'm not gonna go through the unboxing because the unboxing experience is the same as Red Magic 8 Pro. If you want, you can check my Red Magic 8 Pro review video. Well, this is Red Magic 8S Pro. This one comes with almost the same design language, but yeah, there is a bit of a difference than Red Magic 8 Pro. This one has the same squared of rectangular design. Yeah, this one also has glossy back, but this time there are some circular design, which makes the device even more attractive and gorgeous. In hand, it feels silky smooth. The flat edge of the aluminium frame actually helps to have a better grip, and personally, I like this design. Overall, build quality is super sturdy and super flagship class. Yeah, this one has a very nice metal frame and both the front and rear panel is glass panel. Under this glass panel, there are hidden RGB lights. Yeah, there is an active cooling fan, which also comes with its own RGB light setup. Red Magic 8S Pro comes with a Samsung Isocell GN5 sensor, but there is no typical rear camera block. Rather, there is a subtle protruding bump for each sensor and lens. Yeah, this design actually makes it look even better. On top, there is a 3.5mm port, a secondary noise cancellation microphone and a dedicated secondary speaker for proper stereo sound output. Primary speaker, USB-C port, primary microphone and a dual SIM compact SIM tray, everything is located at the bottom. Please note that this is a USB-C 3.1 port, so this one supports the fastest data transfer rate. The air outlet of the active cooling fan is located on the left side. Volume rockers are also located on the left side. Air inlet vent is located on the right side and there are two gaming buttons which is known as shoulder triggers. These are 520Hz gaming buttons so definitely very responsive and very smooth. Power button, another mic for better gaming experience and a dedicated game lobby slider. Yeah, these are all located on the right side. Okay, I need to mention that I'm a sucker for transparent design, but this design also looks pretty nice, pretty gorgeous. Red Magic 8S Pro comes with a 6.8 inch FHD Plus AMOLED display panel. This display panel also has an under display camera. And that is the most important thing I guess. Because we have all the display real estate without any interruption on the display panel. The 6.8 inch AMOLED panel of Red Magic 8S Pro is one of the best in its class and this one comes with ultra thin bezels. This one offers a vivid display performance with 120Hz refresh rate and this one can go very bright as this one has a peak brightness of 1300 nits. All the standard features are there along with some exclusive features which makes user experience much more smooth. Altogether, on paper, this is a proper flagship class display panel. But in reality, the display performance is even better than its specifications. It's one of the best display panels that I've ever seen on any gaming smartphones. Natural yet a vivid and vibrant color reproduction, true dark black and super white bright. I feel like Red Magic, the brand, has really got some magic. They have turned the dream into reality. I have access to all the flagship devices, yet I have been using this Red Magic 8S Pro as my primary device for entertainment because this one comes with the best display panel. Kudos to Red Magic. Stereo speaker setup of Red Magic 8S Pro is another thing that has shocked me with an overwhelming performance. Red Magic 8S Pro supports Snapdragon Sound and DTS. 
Let's check the sound quality and you decide by yourself how good is the performance. Yeah, she might be pretty, but I promise it gets scary. When she wants your daddy and she finds out where you live. Creeping in the shadows, eating poison apples. She is nothing like you ever seen. Yeah, I think this is the best among all the synthetic benchmarks. I'm talking about 3D Mark. There are a few options. I prefer Wildlife Extreme Stress Test. This test consists of 20 loops, which actually checks both the performance and the thermal management. Let's check what type of score and stability this Red Magic 8S Pro can achieve. Wow, I'm not surprised. I was actually expecting something like this. Highest loop score is 3911, the stability rate is 98.3%. So this Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 leading version with 3.36 GHz core speed can really offer a very good performance with stability. Personally, I don't like Antutu Benchmark because most of the time Antutu scores doesn't convert into real life performance. Anyway, after running Antutu Benchmark back to back twice, Red Magic 8S Pro has managed to score 1,628,000, which is the best among all the smartphones available on the market. Okay, I believe that most of the people would buy Red Magic for its gaming performance. So, how good is the gaming performance of Red Magic 8S Pro? Red Magic is a gaming brand. There is a dedicated game lobby slider on the right side of the phone. Inside game lobby, there are hundreds of options to select and tune to get the optimum performance and stability while playing games. There is an option to select CPU and GPU frequency. We can select between Eco, Balanced and Rise, but I think you will barely need the maximum frequency. Even in balanced mode, this one performs like a monster. Sorry, I'm wrong. Not like a monster. Red Magic 8S Pro is a monster. There is an extra chip known as Red Core R2. That one is embedded on the main board. This chipset takes care of audio, RGB and haptics so that the leading version of Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 which is used in this Red Magic 8S Pro can focus on performance. Talking about performance, Red Magic 8S Pro offers the most fluid in-game experience with the highest frame rate for a very long time. During a 100 minutes gaming session, we have noticed that the frame rate actually remained stable at 59 frames per second. That's really a great consistency. Thanks to its ICE 12 cooling system, which is enhanced with a high thermal conductivity gel, composite graphene, and an active cooling fan with 20,000 RPM. This one actually optimizes thermal performance by 150%. The truth is, in real life, there is no other smartphone which can even come close to Red Magic 8S Pro. Because Red Magic 8S Pro comes with shoulder gaming buttons with 520Hz refresh rate, which works even more than better. Red Magic Studio and Graffiti X transform the Red Magic 8S Pro into a portable console, enabling a effortless connection to the Red Magic gamepad, gaming monitor, mechanical keyboard, and gaming mouse. On top of all these features, don't forget that Red Magic 8S Pro comes with a great uninterrupted display panel which can offer a very stable and very high refresh rate. Yeah, gaming on Red Magic 8S Pro is more than fun, so I will give this one for 10 out of 10 for its performance. Red Magic 8S Pro has the same main sensor as its predecessor Red Magic 8 Pro. It's a Samsung Isocell GN5 50MP sensor which grabs nice photos. And the other two sensors are also the same. There is a 8MP ultrawide and a 2MP macro sensor. I'm disappointed to see that this phone is still missing OIS and a good ultrawide sensor. Anyway, let's check the camera performance of this Red Magic 8S Pro. I would give this one 8 out of 10 considering that this is a gaming smartphone.
Red Magic 8S Pro Global Edition comes with a 65W charging brick included inside the box. Yeah, Red Magic 8S Pro has a massive 6000 mAh battery and this 65W charger may sound a bit on a slower side. But the truth is, when turbocharging is enabled, Red Magic 8S Pro gets fully charged, I mean from 0 to 100 within 30 minutes. So that's pretty fast enough. I have managed to squeeze 7 hours of screen on time on my Red Magic 8S Pro with very heavy gaming sessions. With the same usage pattern, the newest Asus ROG phone offers only 6 hours of screen on time. That means Red Magic 8S Pro actually offers longer screen on time than many other gaming smartphones. Red Magic 8S Pro runs on Red Magic OS 8 and Android 13. It is pretty close to stock Android and as Red Magic offers a long-term update, we are gonna get major Android updates for years. The special feature of this Red Magic 8S Pro is charge separation. I really love this feature. As far as I know, Red Magic is the first brand to add this feature on any smartphone and then some other brands have copied it. When we enable this feature, our phone will not get charged, so the battery will not generate any heat. The charger will only power the smartphone, that means the phone will neither draw any power from the battery nor will recharge the battery. What a cool way to keep our gaming session cool. The cooling fan has its own RGB light setup, let's check. I really like the hidden RGB light strip too, because this is amazing, this is subtle, yet at the same time, vibrant. No 3D ultrasonic sensor on Red Magic 8S Pro. I wish next year Red Magic will upgrade this old school in display fingerprint sensor to a 3D ultrasonic fingerprint sensor. Anyway, this old school in display fingerprint sensor works fine, it's fast and accurate, no complaint. Also, there is an option for face unlock. This is a 2D face unlock, so not that secure, but pretty fast and smooth. You won't even notice it, because this is even faster than Flash. Finally, I need to mention Red Magic 8S Pro comes with Widevine L1 certification, so we can enjoy HD streaming on this smartphone without any hassle. And yeah, if you wanna use banking applications, you can do that without worrying, because Red Magic 8S Pro has passed this safety net test, so definitely this is a very safe and secure smartphone. Well, finally, here comes my verdict. Red Magic 8S Pro costs only 649 US dollars, while Nothing Phone 2 costs 699 US dollars. Nothing Phone 2 comes with 8 plus Gen 1 chipset, Red Magic 8S Pro comes with 8 Gen 2 chipset. So you decide which one you wanna get. Do you wanna go for the fun or do you wanna get the best performance? I'm gonna go for Red Magic 8S Pro. What about you? Please don't forget to make a comment in the comment section below. If you have liked this video, then please don't forget to click on the like button and please subscribe to this channel. Support honest content.